morning YouTube it's Ashley here and welcome back to my channel today I am going to do a bit of a travel vlog I have to go out of town for work gotta go to a conference it's only one day so I'm gonna go down there today come back tomorrow so cool let's do it but I figured why not make this into some content and make it a travel vlog and the main intention of this is not to like follow the travel but to stay healthy while I travel <laughs> uh, so I have to go to Georgia today um, and the work that I do I have to have a license and these licenses have to be maintained yearly and usually everybody will let you do your license or your continuing education through online courses uh, webinars lunch and learns where speakers come out they present a topic to you you learn something you get a credit not this state that I have to go to. I have to go to one for Alabama, but luckily I don't have to go to Alabama this time. I have to go to Georgia. And I'm gonna fly into Atlanta today and go up to LaGrange and go sit for eight hours and listen to somebody talk about laws and, and, and procedure and ethics. Fun times, right? But the cool thing about the place that I'm going to today, it is gonna be at the Great Wolf Wilderness Lodge Resort one of those indoor water parks. Why did I choose that location? IDK, I just got excited because there was a water park there. I only have so many hours for the first day, but I'm gonna go. So I'm going to try to go. I'm gonna fast until, you know, my normal time. My flight's at 11. I usually stop fasting at 12, so I'll have an, a bit of an extended fast today so I get some food once I get off the plane. But my plan is to, you know, go, get there, pick up my rental car, get to the resort, and try to, one, get a workout in, because that's just what I'm about this year. I'm trying to get the strength training and resistance training, all that good stuff done. And two, just maintain eating good while I'm out of town, because most people, when they go out of town, we eat like what we want. We, we get all the desserts, all the fattening food, we get all that. So that is my intention of vlogging this time, to keep myself honest, um, especially when the company's paying for it, you kind of go out your way. So we're going to do our best to just watch what we eat, get in a little bit of light exercise today and tomorrow before the conference and go home and get right back into our routine. So y'all follow along with me. YouTube I made it I am here in Atlanta well I'm, I think I'm right outside the uh, Atlanta area I am in my rental car it was a little bit of a struggle getting my car together but I've got it all now I'm actually getting ready to go meet up with one of my cousins my cousin lives down here and I've been wanting to come down to Georgia anyways to kick it with her and I might come back just to like visit or whatever and not on a work type thing but since i have some some time today the conference isn't until tomorrow i'm gonna go link up with my cousin y'all i'm gonna do my best to eat reasonably i'm not gonna like be strict strict but i'm gonna eat reasonably so let's just drive around until i can meet up with her we're gonna look at the city y'all see y'all later
night and I'm sorry, I'm trying to get the light right. I'm back, finally in my room. Y'all seen the room, I showed y'all the room, nothing special. Just a family oriented kind of space for great little lodge, whatever this is called. It's fine for one night, it'll get me first. So I went to lunch with my cousin and I had a great time. Definitely enjoyed the conversation with her and the food was good. Um, getting back to the hotel, I got check in was at four. I didn't get here till 7.30, 8 o'clock. And now I'm gonna have a late dinner. And I stopped at the resort to get one of the meals that had, that was all open, a lot of stuff was closed and I'm not going back out. And I got sirloin steak and, oh my God, if I can open it for y'all. Sirloin steak and potato wedges. Doesn't look all that appetizing. It's supposed to be garlic parm, potato wedges. It looks ass. I'm gonna eat this and then I'm gonna possibly try to get in a quick 20 minute workout. But I closed all my rings with all the walking I did today. There you go, you see that, you see that? All the walking I did today, I did close my activity ring and my exercise ring. So anything extra, it's just good. So let me get into this meal before it gets any later and then I'm gonna stop so I can fast for the rest of the evening. So the day is over and I'm in bed. I'm all washed up, all ready to go to sleep, get ready for this conference tomorrow. Just wanted to kind of recap my day. I think it was a very well accomplished day as far as trying to remain healthy. So I started off my day, of course, on my flight and I maintained my fast until about 12.30 and I broke that with a Diet Coke and a bag of sun chips a little like snack pack that kind of bag it was the cheddar whatever sun chips they were only 70 calories from the diet coke whatever that is i think it's zero calories but that was what i broke my fast with and then i didn't eat again until about 4 35 and that's when i met up with my cousin and i had grilled salmon or it's supposed to be blackened salmon and i had collard greens and candy yams with it. Now, I did not finish all the candy yams, and we know that's not a little carb, but candy yams, has its, or yams have a ton of nutrients in it, so I'm not mad about that. I did eat the garlic toast on the plate. Oh well, it was delicious, so we just small concessions here and there, right? And then with that, I tried my best to keep my drink low carb, so I avoided the syrupy, fruity cocktails, like uh, the margaritas and those type of things. I just went for Diet Coke and Hennessy. And I normally don't drink that, but they really didn't have any of the other liquors that I drank. So I went with what they had and I looked it up and Hennessy for like an ounce is like less than a car. So I think I did really good there. And um, I enjoyed my time with my cousins and just let you guys know that I'll insert clips somewhere kind of showing my day. And um, that was it for that. Then when I got to the hotel, I didn't get to the hotel until like 7 30, 8 o'clock. So I ate a little later than I normally like to do. I ate beyond my eating window, but it is what it is. That and then I ate my little Atkins bar. You guys have seen me eat that before, the little caramel nut roll. It was a great way to end my night. That's a three net car. So all in all I did really well. The only thing I kinda wish I did more was drink water. But I don't like to drink that much when I'm traveling. I just, I don't know, I always have a fear of their Hold on. Okay, sorry about that. Um, I had to get a ironing board. They didn't have one in the room for some crazy reason, but like I was saying, I didn't get as much water as I would have liked to, but we can always make sure we do that tomorrow. I will finish out my vlog tomorrow with showing what I eat at the actual conference. And they usually have like a buffet of things, so I'll try to pick out the healthier options. The food usually isn't good, so I won't feel bad if I don't, like, I won't overeat, let's say that. I won't overindulge, because usually the food's trash, so. <laughs> we'll show, we'll, we'll vlog tomorrow, and then I'll close it out, and see y'all later. So on the day of the conference, I made sure to at least record my snacks and my meals. Um, did my best to include tea or water, diet soda with everything, and make sure I got some vegetables in where they were available. 
I did allow myself a few snacks here and there, like that um, lemon bar, but I didn't eat the goldfish. It was time to head back home after the conference, and I did make sure that I recorded my snacks at the airport, and I ate everything except the rice and the dry biscuit you see there, and then I also got a Starbucks drink, but I wouldn't recommend this one. It was one of those TikTok drinks, and I think I only took three sips, but it's time to head home. trip is over it's about 10 30 at night i'm just gonna do a few things before i get into bed but i just want to say thank you for watching this whole video if you did i appreciate all of my viewers anybody who shares the video likes the video it's very much appreciated thank you so much for watching stay around i will have another video next week around the same time thanks love you all bye